My name is Fernando Heredia, or Fernando No Mercy Heredia. I'm from Chicago, Illinois, originally. I'm here, I'm, sta I'm stationed in Washington through the military, and uh, I fight out of ground game BJJ and Universal Mixed Martial Arts. I've been training for about eight and a half years. Uh, four of those years uh, were uh, pure wrestling. Uh, I tried uh, wrestling collegially uh, or in college, and uh, it didn't work out too well academically, so I had to drop out of college. Uh, the rest of it's uh, a lot of jiu-jitsu, uh, a lot of kickboxing, a lot of boxing. Uh, just overall becoming a well-rounded uh, MMA fighter, mixed martial arts. When I realized I wanted to become a fighter was when I uh, I stepped in in a fight on little to no training. Uh, I was right out of high school. Once again, I dropped out of uh, college wrestling and uh, I jumped into a fight and I got beat up by a better, a better, more athletic opponent. And uh, from there, I just, I knew I was better and, and the poor performance that I showed, I knew was not me. So I, I strived to be a better fighter, a better, more well-rounded mixed martial artist. My friends and family were very supportive. Um, my friends basically told the world that I was an MMA fighter. Uh, my family was also very supportive. They, all, they always try to watch my fights whenever they're live, anywhere on any website. Uh, all, my friends do also, they, they get together like it's a Super Bowl party. Uh, my family was a little bit scared just because of the dangers that come with being a, a fighter, but they had nothing to worry about because I always reassured them that I was putting in the man hours that it took to be the best and to, to walk in and walk out with little to no damage. My biggest inspiration is my family. Uh, my family and more of my kids uh, my kids are, are probably the biggest inspiration to, to what I do and why I do it. Uh, without them, I wouldn't strive to be the best. I wouldn't, you know, I, I wouldn't have the motivation I do to get up every day um, because I want to show them that I, I am great. I was great, and, and they can look up to me, and, and I will be the role model, and they don't have to be inspired by anybody else but me. I think what separates me from other fighters, well, what I know separates me from other fighters is is the, the sacrifice that I have to put in day in and day out. Uh, I'm not only a, a mixed martial artist, a professional mixed martial artist, I'm, I'm an active duty, full active duty soldier, I'm a full-time college student, a full-time father, and, and on top of that, I'm, I'm a professional fighter who, who puts in the hours and the time and, and the sacrifice, and I, I sacrifice a lot. I sacrifice a lot of sleep, a lot of time with my family, you know, I cut them short to, to strive to be the best and, and show them that, that it could be done. My mindset going into a fight, I, I'm, I'm usually really calm. I mean, I take a nap before day of, like while we're there. I get my hands wrapped, I take a nap, and I'm really calm. I don't, I don't think about much, I'm just relaxed. Uh, but as soon as that, that cage closes, uh, it's like a, I'm like a storm. I'm the calm before the storm, before the fight starts. And once that cage closes, boom, there goes thunder and lightning and all that shit. And, and I come out <laughs> like, a, like a storm, man. You don't get up in the morning one day and just decide to be an MMA fighter and decide that, oh, I can just go in the gym and the next day fight. It doesn't, it doesn't work that way. It takes a lot of time, a lot of motivation, a lot, a lot of sacrifice to be the best. I mean, I spend countless hours without well, I mean, in the mornings, I, I wake up at 3 to go run and prepare my day for the day ahead of me, the day of work, the day, day to come train, and, and still at the same time enjoy it and love it. It's, it's, if you're not willing to sacrifice time and sleep and, and things that are precious to you, you you're not going to make it. I mean, it, you, it takes a lot, and, and a major part of it is sacrifice. I wake up before the sun comes up, I run 5 to 10 miles. I get ready for work, I go to work. Once again, I put another training session in before work starts. That's a, a lifting session, more explosive training. Uh, once work's over, I, I undress and I get dressed to go to war. I'm coming to practice and, and, and training with some beasts, man, that beat you up. And uh, That's another three, three and a half hours of training. And it takes a toll, it takes, it takes a lot. It takes that extra, that extra push, that extra, that extra sacrifice of getting up 
and doing more and being more than, than your opponent.